good morning. It's your boy Trust My Level. So let's get into this real quick. So I'm just looking at the entire market right now for free market. Looking here, you're going to hear this a couple times. I can already tell you this on Twitter. You're going to hear it everywhere from the stratters that we have a mother bar problem. Okay, so at 830, you can see that mother bar. Whew, you got to get outside of that bar or we're going to be ranging throughout the day. So, uh, and this happened on each and every major futures market, okay? So you can see ES on the left, top left. You can see uh, NQ, you can see uh, Russell there. Um, and then you can see Dow here on the right, stop right. So every single one has that mother bar problem. So look out for that. And you can see they all bounced at the same area. So um, remember, these are computers trading this, okay? Computers are trading this. There's no retail traders moving all four of these markets at the same time, all right? Remember that. Remember that. And this is at nighttime. This is not nighttime, but pre-market. So most retail traders are trading after, you know, 930. So just, just pay attention to that. So you got to get outside of this bar to actually, you know, make some, some moves. So, um, yeah, all right? Just remember that. Uh, let's see here. Let me move this out the way. If it lets me, it does. Cool. So with that, I have these particular levels here for SPX. Um, this is on the five minute. You know, the average ATR on the five minute is about $5. So um, don't be, you know, like scared. You see it move up five and then it pulls back, moves down five and pull back type of deal. So that's the ATR for five minute. So right now, um, just, just looking at what's going on in, on the futures market, these are the levels that I have right now for SPX, okay? It's just, of course, might change um, once the market opens, but for right now, this is what I have. So just just bear with it. All right, so first profit box is at 3804, 3803. These are very tight uh, because of the movement here. So, you know, we might be going off these fibs from yesterday also because of the tight range that they have right here. So you got 3804, 3803, 3801, 3800. 37.98 down there. Um, and then you have your other side up there, 38.10, 38.13, and 38.16. So this is a very tight range. Um, of course, we could go outside of this. I'm just, you know, just looking at what we have based on the information of what we got. So, you know, continue to look at your fibs from yesterday um, because, again, until we get outside of that mother bar um, that I just showed you, these over here, until we get outside of these, you know, we're going to have an issue trying to push higher and push lower. We just got to get outside of it. Okay. That's it. So, um, all right. If you got any questions, hit me up. Let me know. Send me a message on Instagram. Send me a message on Twitter. Send me a message wherever you're going to send it. All right. We're going to get it and I'll see you later. Oh, yeah. Matter of fact, when you get your, get your contracts loaded up, just make sure you have your contracts ready to go. Okay. So if you want to target one of these, make sure you got your contracts ready to go. That's the other information I have for you. Don't be, don't fumble around trying to figure out what contracts you want to get. All right, talk to y'all later.